So now when I go into runtime, what I've done is I've brought in my HMI card to show up at the finished water pump station, being that finished water pump station overview screen. And that is all we had to do is we just bind it as opposed to have to script it or put a high level of customization for navigation. And then furthermore, I, I once had about six pens being displayed on that screen. Now I only have three for the trend card. So if I were to go to the trend full screen card, I would see that instead of the six pens I had, now I have three. And this shows how you can configure all of the appropriate relevant information that shows up in context to that location in the model. So it's a very simple process to configure your screens, to export them out into this new HTML5 environment. And then once you bring them into this environment after they've been exported, it's a very, very simple checkbox configuration or uh, binding configuration to associate information with each other that our model keeps track of for you. So again, as we step through the model, we see all of the relevant information that is associated with that model show up in context. And that really is a lot of what we're driving here is showing information in context to users, again, so that they have all the necessary pieces of information to make the accurate decisions quickly.